With Creo Elements Direct, I can freely explore different design possibilities. I'm designing the back cover of a new low-cost handheld media player. Our finished product looks like this, but let's go back to the concept stage when I only had some general requirements from marketing. I don't need to know much about the final design at this stage because direct modeling lets me make changes whenever they are needed. First, I'll try moving this outer curved surface. I can make the most of my changes by interacting directly with a model. Notice that I just select geometry and then apply the change. I move it in a direction relative to another face or edge. The 3D Copilot defines the direction and length to the transformation. Notice that Creo Elements Direct maintains the blends and recreates them with the face I changed. This time, I'll grab the curved surface as well as the inside surface of the breakout and move them in the same direction. The faces move together even though they aren't permanently linked. Again, the system recreates the blends with the transformation. Creo Elements Direct can intelligently recognize features. I can select the inside square hole as a temporary feature, which I can adjust and move as a single unit. These groups aren't persistent, but I can define them when needed. I can also offset the opening to make it smaller or larger. All faces of the feature are offset. Now I'll move the pocket and the outer face. I'll draw a box around the faces I need. Any face inside the box will be selected. The direct modeling approach makes it easy to make direct changes by interacting with the model's geometry.